Welcome back to our channel where we provide you with the latest updates on the Iraqi dinar. Today we have significant development to discuss. Iraqi Central Bank Action The Iraq Central Bank's decision to revoke Iran's bank M operating license underscore the seriousness of both Iraq and the U.S. in preventing Iran access to U.S. dollar. This move also highlights Iraq's commitment to aligning with the U.S. Treasury Department to safeguard its considerable reserve held in the Federal Reserve. Report indicated that Iraq is experiencing a high price stability and reduction in parallel market disturbance, indicating positive economic trend within the country. Increase in trade with South Korea. Recent reports confirm a rise in trade volume between Iraq and South Korea, attributed to the improved security situation in Iraq. Insights from a bank visitor suggest that potential discussion within financial institutions regarding foreign currency investment indicating a growth interest in currencies like the dinar and dong. U.S. Embassy Expansion Noteworthy is the expansion of the U.S. Embassy in Baghdad with plans for a significantly larger facility. This development raises questions about the U.S. presence in Iraq and potential long-term strategies. Clarifying discussions around the possible loop theory, it's confirmed that a loop would indeed reduce the value of the dinar as exemplified by 25,000 dinar becoming a 25 dinar. Intel suggests that the lower notes and coins may soon be introduced with speculation of their reveal in the coming weeks. Stakeholders are advised to stay vigilant for updates. In conclusion, these developments underscore this involving landscape of the Iraqi dinar and its implication on global financial dynamics. We encourage our viewers to stay informed and prepare for potential shift in the currency's value. Stay tuned for more updates on our channel. Thanks for watching.